is how to create a pop-out effect using a logo here in CorelDRAW. It's very simple and very very easy to do. So without any further ado, let's begin. So these are the resources we make, the resources we'll be making use of for this video. All right. Um, this is the image I have here, and this is the logo here. So um, we'll be making use of this. And so um, the criteria for this is that the image must be a PNG that is it has no background. I also have a video in the description below on how to remove background so you can check it out so um we, this is what we're creating here this year so let me give this a background so um yes this is what we'll be creating here yes this pop out effect is in this logo here all right so so first of all you will power clip this image into this logo so this is a vector logo here so yes Alright, so you still have access to it. So just select the image, then right click, then power clip, and power clip inside here. So I also have a video in the description below on how to power clip, a detailed video, so you can check it out later. Alright, so you enter the power clip. Alright, so you adjust your own preference now. So uh, you make sure the image um, extends over this blue line here that is the logo frame here make sure it, um, it, it extends over it all right so so you drag this image to the top a bit hold control to maintain balance so you drag to the top a bit all right so this is fine so you can also drag it behind here all right so this is actually very fine all right so once that is done you make use of the pen tool so you come to your toolbar section and select the pen tool so um i only want this area where the leaf starts from this curved area I only want um the content there so i don't want this area that has the hand or anything so from this area so i'll cut out this area so you click here so you zoom for a better view so i'll delete this area Alright, so yeah, so just do this place. So bring it back, then you double click. So hit on the space bar to deselect the pen tool. So once that's done, you select this, then hold shift, then you select this image. Then you come to your property bar, then you select trim. Yeah, so you've removed this area, so you delete. Yes. Alright, so you select this image ctrl c then you exit the power clip we also have a video in the description below on how to exit power clip it's a detailed video you can check it out later all right so remember we copied the image right so you paste ctrl v yes so what do we do next you head on to your property bar and you select the shape tool so once you you've pasted this um image you don't move it or anything so um you select the image then you hold on to your toolbar then you select the shape tool then you adjust this as you can see it's making so much sense so you adjust this to fit so you double click on this area yes so you adjust this until it comes out very well all right so you adjust this one to this yeah so why it's coming out like this is because we have a duplicate inside the power clip so whatever we move it so long as it's still within that area it's going to come out very well so this is it yeah this is it so you adjust this a bit yes you adjust this so you carefully do this so you adjust this so once you're done you just can just move this so this is it basically 
this is it so you can just highlight everything ctrl g then p to free to join page and double click on the rectangle tool then you give it this background color then right click to remove the outline here so guys um this is it the logo pop out effect here in coral draw so um it's very simple and um very very easy to do also i have a video in the description below on how to create this logo so this logo was for um a cosmetic brand so you can check it out i have a detailed video on how i did it how i created the logo so you can check it out in the description below so um that is it on this video so you can also edit this yeah, so this is it yes so all right guys um, um if you find this video helpful do how to hit on the subscribe button turn on post notification bell to get notified whenever i upload new videos and don't forget to like share and comment on our videos thank you for watching and see you on the next video tutorial